Hello, Life Changers and guests. I'm Deacon Mike Cook of the New Life in Christ Parking Lot Ministry, along with the other brothers who are representative of the Parking Lot Ministry. We are the men entrusted to ensure your safe and expeditious arrival to the sanctuary. We produce a training video that we hope that you find informative. Thank you. Welcome to the New Life in Christ NLIC Parking Lot Ministry or PLM, where we serve together as a friendly, inviting, and people-oriented ministry committed to ensure a welcoming experience, set a cheerful tone that sets the stage for worship, encouraging life changers to return, and visitors to connect with the NLIC family. Our goal is to provide safety, order, and security on the parking lot during Sundays, Wednesdays, revivals, funerals, and special programs in such a way that the congregation can attend services or events in a timely manner. We encourage life changers to follow the direction of the parking lot minister at all times. We developed this video to help life changers better understand what is really going on during their parking lot experience. We hope that you find this video to be informative. We've always reminded life changers and their guests to enter the New Life parking lot from Keck Ridge. Entering from Hilltop Drive has been extremely dangerous as it requires one to slow down on a 55 mile per hour highway where there is no turning lane. We are aware of at least one life changer who was rear-ended while attempting to turn left on Hilltop Drive from Scott Troy Highway. However, change is on the way and soon Scott Troy Highway will be widened to accommodate a safe approach to Hilltop Drive. Drivers entering the parking lot from Keck Ridge should move forward to the main parking lot. At the first row of parking spaces, the parking lot minister will direct vehicles to enter the first parking slot and drive forward, stopping in the second slot as they face Scott Troy Road. When the Hilltop Drive entrance becomes available, drivers entering the NLIC parking lot will either turn right or left as directed by the parking lot minister. Parking lot ministers alternate parking slots to allow occupants to exit the previously parked car safely. This procedure will continue until the first two rows are completely filled. Filling up the second row requires drivers to drive to the third lane as the parking lot minister directs vehicles entering the first parking slot and drive forward, stopping in the second slot as they face the church. Following this guidance encourages forward movement of cars and reduces backing. But for those who prefer to back into a parking space, we encourage them to use the perimeter parking along the fence and Scott Troy Road. Drivers should communicate to the parking lot minister of their desire to back in by stopping their vehicle and raising their hand and turning it in a circular motion in such a way that the parking lot minister sees and understands their intent. The parking lot minister will direct the following traffic in order for the driver to back in. Life changers are encouraged to invite their friends and family to New Life. When they do so, they should instruct them to enter via Keck Ridge and to turn on their hazard lights when they drive into the lot. The flashing lights alert the parking lot minister that this is a very special guest that will be parked as a first time visitor on the left front side of the walkway leading to the church entrance. The parking lot minister will direct them to the nearest slot and wait for them to exit their vehicle. He'll welcome them to New Life, introduce himself, and escort them to the entrance of the church and introduce and hand them off to the greeter at the door. We have 15 slots set aside for our handicapped lag changers and guests. Two slots are north of the church, just right of the drop-off lane towards the overhang. An additional four slots are directly in front of the church in the drop-off lane two before and two after the overhang. There are nine slots on the right front side of the walkway leading to the church entrance. If first time visitors or handicapped drivers desire to back into their respective slots, they may do so simply by stopping their vehicle and raising their hand and turning it in a circular motion in such a way that the parking lot minister sees and understands their intent. As the 8.30 service time approaches, the less parking slots there will be available on the main parking lot. Once the main lot is full, life changers and guests will be directed to the rear of the church and to the gravel lot. 
In the event all church spaces are full, we suggest life changers and guests park in the adjoining housing development in such a way as to avoid blocking mailboxes, driveways, fire hydrants, and intersections. At the end of services, drivers parked on the main parking lot are encouraged to exit via Hilltop Drive. The first and second rows of cars are already facing the middle lane, which leads directly to the Hilltop Drive exit. Drivers parked along the fence and the gravel lot is encouraged to exit via Keck Ridge. As part of our recruitment of new parking lot ministers, we are looking for a few good men who don't mind telling people where to go with a smile and the love of Jesus Christ on their hearts. Beloved, you do faithfully whatever you do for the brethren and for strangers. That is 3 John chapter 1, verse 5.